Giving the gift of an organ. Today, transplant organizations are encouraging you to wear blue and green, which is the official Donate Life colors. Our Megan Kernan joins us now live in West St. Louis with some common misconceptions. Megan? Good morning, Rennie and Mercedes. Well, today you are asked to dress in blue and green to help raise awareness about organ donations. Signing up to be a donor only takes a couple of minutes. Now, as you can see on your video of the memory wall at Mid-America Transplant, many have made the choice to donate, but plenty of people don't sign up to donate because of so many myths. So we want to address some of those misconceptions. Hospitals don't allow just anyone to donate. You have to go through a rigorous process process and doctors will work just as hard to save the lives of organ donors as non donors. One donor can save up to eight lives with eye donors able to restore sight to two people. Tissue donors can enhance up to 75 lives. Now our colleague Ann Allred's life was saved by a kidney transplant seven years ago. Take a listen. I would not be standing here if it wasn't for my friend from high school who stepped up, got tested, and gave me one of his kidneys. Whenever you poll Americans, over 90% of people say they support donation, but only about 50 to 60% of people actually sign up on the donor registry. Now, Mid-America Transplant says nearly 1,400 people are on the wait list in our area. 35% of that wait list is made up of minorities. Live in West St. Louis, Megan Kernan, 5 on your side.